Christmas shopping was brought to a standstill in Coventry yesterday afternoon following reports of a pantomime prank which ended in tragedy. Bemused shoppers looked on in horror as the disjoint head and back legs of what was later confirmed to be a pantomime cow were recovered from Broadgate Central Square at 1200 hours amidst cries of, oh no it isn't, and oh yes it is, from onlooking crowds. The victim, who goes by the name of Daisy, was last seen exiting Coventry's Belgrade Theatre in the early hours of Wednesday morning during rehearsals for the theatre's alternative B2 Christmas crime thriller, Oh No It Isn't. The death was originally assumed to be the result of a severe case of stage fright when police recovered a loaded pistol from Daisy's lower left udder. After a second post-mortem, it was revealed that the pantomime cow was a victim of poisoning. Police are now treating the death as suspicious after receiving reports of two actors exiting the Belgrade stage door in the early hours of Wednesday, carrying an apple and an object later confirmed to be a slapstick. Fellow cast members Sal and Jackie are said to be utterly devastated by the news. I'm utterly devastated. Tony and I have been great friends ever since I saw his bottom in Frinton in, in 1991. And his death is going to have a, a huge, huge impact on the theatrical industry. I'm sorry. Well, of course, we all know that there is actually a poisoned apple in the plot of the panto, but none of us were anticipating that someone would actually come and poison it. Um, it really is a, a shock to all of us. Um, and to be honest, I have no idea who could have done this really beats me. Writer-director Nick Walker was on the scene to offer his thoughts. My name's Nick Walker and I'm the director of Oh No It Isn't and uh, it has a cast of four including a very talented pantomime cow but early on this morning as I was walking through Coventry City Centre I stumbled across a horrific scene. Uh, my two halves of the pantomime cow have literally come apart and they're dead here in Broadgate and we don't know who did it. My suspicions are two of my cast members who have turned up, Jackie the principal boy and the giant, but they're saying nothing. So I was outside B2, outside the stage door, and I was all these two guys just loitering around. In fact, I think one was a one was a woman, but I, I couldn't be sure like, but she was definitely older than an apple. Police in Coventry are appealing for witnesses to come forward to get to the bottom of who's been stalking who. This is Kate Evans, reporting live for the six o'clock news uh news.